Getting set for a one-on-one -on -one action here tonight. From behind, he's attacked from behind. Oh, come on, this is so blatantly obvious. He's trying to screw him over before the start of the matchup. Yeah, I think it worked. Game plan successful. Now ring the bell, referee. The official gonna make sure that the uh, competitor's ready start to go. Start the match. And he does. The ref better get this thing under control real quick. I believe that is the first time tonight we've seen that move. I don't know if we've seen that from him before. I mean, it's definitely a first tonight. This is great. This guy will try anything. What do you think's going through Curtis Axel's mind? I'll tell you. If he came here looking for the fans' respect, he came to the wrong place. This crowd detests him. He appears to have his game face on tonight, and he better, because the guy he's in the ring there with is no nonsense. I gotta say, I don't know why these people hate him so much. I actually find him quite personable. He saw that one coming. This guy's kicks are so impactful. Clearly on a mission here. He gets out of trouble there. Here's a cover. Look at this action, and there's still plenty to come. Oh, yeah, let's go. Boy, he was able to reverse it and get out of that. A quick reversal by Curtis Axel. He was able to reverse that. You know, we've talked about Curtis Axel's incredible family history in this business. So it makes complete sense that he's powerful, tough as nails, ruthless, and skilled on the mat. Well, and dare I say, perfect when it comes to stuffing that WWE rule book right through a paper shredder. Yet? Yeah, but many more of those than it will be. Oh, it's going to take more than that to keep him down tonight. He's delivering an old-fashioned butt-kicking right here. I don't remember the last time he executed that maneuver. Curtis Axel's strength and ring savvy makes him a nightmare to compete against. Axel possesses great lateral movement and is not afraid to leave his feet to inflict pain on an opponent. Curtis will push his opposition right over the limit and pull out all the stops to score a victory. Well, Curtis Axel has had some great mentors throughout his career. They've helped him hone his natural gifts of strength, speed, to great counter. Will he be victorious? I think this is it. Two. And the shoulder's up now. That's a kick out. Nice. Just when you thought it was over. Wow. And now he goes for it a second time. Curtis Axel with the excellent move to get out. Looking for all. And the shoulder's up now. That's a kick out. Nice. I can't believe it. He just won't go away. Few superstars are as dominant as this guy. Well, that's the first time we've seen that move tonight from either locker room. I kind of love it. You don't see that move every day. He's too busy bragging and boasting and battling in this matchup. Oh boy, but it's Axel Snapmare. Watch this move. Anticipated that move perfectly. Perfectly executed. One. Oh, what an escape as he gets the shoulder up at two. Man, I thought that was going to be enough, Cole. I don't believe it. He refuses to lose. He's too busy bragging and boasting and battling in this matchup. Taking a risk here. What makes a man even want to take a gamble like that, King? How should I know? I'm scared of heights. We got to cover. One. 
Oh, look at that. He managed to get a shoulder up. Well, like they say, Cole, timing is everything. He simply refuses to stay down. A quick reversal there by Curtis Axel. Boy, he just got laid out. A knockdown drag out brawl complete with a big stomp. Man, these guys are throwing bombs. They're pulling out all the stops. Really pushing his opponent to the limit here. Trying to get under his opponent's skin with this one. Plenty of can't miss TV on Thursday, but nothing more can't miss than this broadcast of WWE television. I don't know how much more damage he can take. Three. Back in the ring now. Knocked down. What a shot. in serious trouble. And this has got to be it. It's it. It's over. He got the job done. This one's over. Here's your winner, the Bruiser, Peter F. Dunn. That's an